All right, we're here with Dr. Marsha Davis in uh, Nequa, Wisconsin. Uh, how are you doing, um, Dr. Davis? Oh, just fine. Yeah? We're bearing the, bearing the northern winter just fine. No snow there, not like 20 inches of snow which don't go away like in Manhattan? <laughs> no, it passed us by, fortunately. All right. We just have the cold. All right. Well, Dr. Davis. Uh, one of the things you do, you do lots of things in your practice. You take care of people with, um, uh, you know, lots of their uh, health problems um, and, and all those things. But you do, you know, things like, for instance, uh, uh, some cosmetic procedures like uh, like uh, like liposuction. And from what I know is actually there are some new equipment in terms of liposuction, which um, which is much better, much you know, gets better. With, salts and equipment which was out there a few years ago. Um, it, it, can you shade some light on that? Oh, sure. Um, there is new equipment out. There have been some uh, laser equipment that has been used in the office. It's been available in the United States for a while. But this new machine called the Body Jet is uh, one of the newer ones that's been available in the United States for about a year now. And it uses water. Uh, it can be done in the office without general anesthesia. And it uses a very, very small cannulas, smaller than half the size of my pinky finger, so that you can contour the body rather than just pump up the, the abdomen or whatever area of the body you're doing, so that you can do very small areas that weren't, that are not possible at all under normal liposuction procedures. Uh, ab absolutely don't need general anesthesia. Uh, body contouring is possible and because you're using water, it actually like picks the fat off the vine like uh, you're picking a grape off the vine. So the fat comes out and it's alive when it comes out. And the beauty of that is you can actually reuse the fat immediately. So if someone would like uh for example, what we call a liquid facelift. You can reuse the fat immediately into the face or the hands or augment the breast or other areas of the body, whereas you can't do that with traditional liposuction because traditional liposuction actually destroys the underlying connective tissue and the blood supply. Also with traditional liposuction, you uh, get a lot of swelling, you get more bruising, you have at least a two-week downtime. Most of my patients we do on Fridays, and they're back to work by Monday or Tuesday. They have ex extremely small amount of discomfort compared to general, uh, general ordinary liposuction. Uh, they can have this option of using their own fats, Matter of fact, if they don't want liposuction but they want to use their own fat for liquid facelift or to augment their hands, for example, if they're getting older and their tendons are starting to show and they're getting wrinkly, uh, they can usually find enough fat on their body to just take out that fat amount just to do that part if they so choose. It's a very, very wonderful new thing that we have. And it's very interesting because a lot of people in cosmetics are using dermal fillers that are foreign to their body to put into their face and hands and other places, including their breasts, such as saline implants or silicone implants, whereas now they can use their own fats. And the interesting thing is the body fat cells have more memory cells than any other part of their body, commonly known as stem cells. We hear a lot about stem cell research. There's more stem cells in fat cells than any other cells in the body. So what we do with these fat cells when we put them back in, it's actually permanent. So you get a permanent effect, not just the swelling and redness. So if you use fat obtained from another method, most of the fat is not alive or what we call viable that can live. So the results from this is really astounding, and it's a very, very wonderful thing that we are able to offer patients now. 
Wonderful. So basically what you're saying is not only uh, does it kind of like work slightly better, it gets more fat out than the old uh, uh, methods, um, uh, but it's also more comfortable for the patient. He's faster back to work and um, he can actually use that. You know, um, exactly. in other in right. other body spots, so he can use his own. Which, yes, as you said, uh, instead of putting a foreign object in it, that must be kind of better. So basically, you get a double warp up for all purpose. Right. Exactly. Sounds exactly. great. It, it is quite. Uh, you know, we keep thinking of technology. Um, um, I mean, anyway, you know, the advancement of technology. You, you know. It is a great thing, you know. He, most of the time we look at it at computers and stuff, and I'm sure this thing is uh, somehow computerized. That's why it does that. But uh, the point is it's 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 wonderful, uh, um, you know, how the technology improves uh, and we can uh, we can not only get healthier, but we, we can look better and, uh, and with less downtime. Well, thanks a lot for shedding some light on that. We'll talk more about liposuction um, in a little bit. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye.